What's up, everybody? Happy Monday. I hope you had a great weekend. Today, we're going to start off this circuit. Two movements. We're going to use the sandbag. That's our tool of the day. Uh, depending on your fitness level, uh, you kind of gauge how much weight you can handle, all right? So what's great about the sandbag is that it's consistently or constantly shifting. So every time you drop, every time you move, um, it's, it's shifting. It's never in one set position as if, you know, you're lifting the dumbbell or barbell, so to speak. Um, so it really forces that core. Now, when I mean the core from your shoulders to your hip to really work hard to stabilize. So a lot of those synergistic muscles, those little muscle groups, those those uh, everything kind of works in together to help, you know, uh, keep you stable. Simple word, right? I'm trying to make it all complex. Keep it simple. What is it called? Uh, simple stupid, right? So today what we're gonna do, uh, we're gonna do two uh, movements. It's gonna be one big movement. It's a power clean. So basically we take the sandbag from the ground, cleaning it up to our shoulders, ball driving into a squat, into an overhead press and resetting. Um, and then we're gonna go into uh, sandbag squat thrusts, all right? So it's a lot going on. You get out of it what you put into it. So always push hard, do the best you can, but never sacrifice form for weight, my friends. All right, so what we're gonna do is, uh, I'll show you from the side, that way you can see my positioning, how I break in my hips, I sit back, I keep my hips above my knees. Um, a lot of everything engaged, I have no play in my arms. So it's just a drive into a squat, into a press. That way we're stimulating as many muscle groups as possible, getting the biggest bang for our buck. So what we're gonna do, we're gonna lie, we're gonna do, start with two uh, reps of the power clean squat press. And then we're gonna go to two squat thrusts. And then what you're gonna do is go into four of each movement, six, eight, ten. Um, if you're feeling really good and you, this is not a finish or you know you're not short for time and you could really bang it out, ladder back down from ten again, eight, six, four to two. Okay? So I'm gonna demo it that way we're on the same page to see um, how you should look. Um, always keep your head neutral, sit back. We're gonna go into the power clean. So I'm gonna rip this baby up using my my hips and my whole body drives, I sit, right? I'm sitting back, dropping my heels into the ground, I'm centered, and then I press. And then I reset, right? Press. Then we're gonna go to the squat thrust, with something like this, a little different. Plank position, stay tight, stay engaged, and straight up, big chest. Knock out those hips, boom. Then we're gonna go into four, right? So I'm done with four. We just go right into it and sit back. One, two, three, four. Right. Squat thrust. One, two, three. Right, little rest as possible, do the best you can, make it happen, because nobody's gonna do it for you. So do it, get up, you can do it. All right, till next time, stay fit, stay strong, Rob, Crank, to have a great one, guys, peace.